Hello everyone and welcome back to Telling Lies. And uh, last time we went through a bunch of names and stumbled upon some further information. And today I just want to continue with more uh, notes that I have written down. I'm not sure how long we will continue, honestly. Feels like um, we're getting closer and closer to a point where I feel like I found most of the things. But uh, so far, I'm, I still want to continue. I want to find out as much as possible. So let's try doing that. Let's start with Cinderella. Cinder, Cinderella, is that how you? There, okay. That one didn't work. Maleficent. I don't know if that is how you write it, honestly. Uh, I think I tried Little Mermaid. Little Mermaid. Oh, there's one that was missing. Okay. It's the uh, Little Mermaid. Yeah, it was too cheap to have it painted over, and it kind of, <laughs> kind of grew on me. Oh, so we need a new name. Okay. Are you gonna come home? Come home! Now! Okay, let's go. Finish up, get the tab, let's go. Come home! See you in 10. Okay. Who's that? Come home. Okay. Uh, Thanksgiving. Okay. Everything there. Okay, put that as well. Where they are singing. Um. All the other things that I have here. Oh yeah, that's something I wanted to try is. We have one. Ooh. Because I felt bad lying to him. But uh, screwing him, that felt like breaking a spell. David, why don't you just tell me what you've been doing over there? You're lying. You're a professional liar. It's literally your job. Yeah, and they trained you how to lie. Make me. God damn it. Oh. Okay. Oof. Okay. Liar. No. I bet you're a great dancer. She'll dance That's what you want. bit all over the place today but uh, I feel like that is just what happens if you chasing some last loose threads black kite oh a couple of ones it's, you got a lot of manpower through black kite okay I found them to be highly professional and their procedures are very thorough. Hmm. Okay. What about this one? Black Kite changed the plan. They decided to go oh. deeper on Greenstorm. Yeah, they agreed to share their intel. It's a good plan. We're all adults. This is a strategic decision we made together. 
You don't. We're putting together the paperwork right now to round up the group and get you some scouts. So as long as a finite operation, it's not a lifestyle. All right, just start working on your exit plan. You need to get your head back in the game. Okay, well that is clearly about David getting kind of lost on the mission. What about if we search for intel? Yeah, that's it. Uh, what else do I have here? So then at the very beginning, he, uh, in the very first video, I think, he was talking about decorating. Oh, maybe not. Moving. There's one. We're moving to the second phase. Soon we're going to round up all your Detroit friends. Everyone was on that boat. Okay, this is going to look like a well-organized operation. She was on the boat. It helps have a pretty face in the lineup. Remind the public the terrorists come in all shapes and sizes. Okay, you need to start following protocol. No! Listen. Listen to me, David. Okay? We are the ones upholding law and order. We are the ones who keep the darkness back. The irony of this job is that to uphold those laws, we're the ones who sometimes have to bend them. Okay? We bend them, we don't break them. I've been doing this for a long time, and I have made my men contort and twist themselves in all manner of ways. But none of them are broken. Please don't be the first. Oof. Okay, protocol, it's only him mentioning it, fine, but protesters, also nothing, uh, what about bad guy, oops, bad guys. Batty. There we have one. Did the guys hit you? You lost a chip too. You can get two dollars from the tooth fairy. They had an argument last night. They're still asleep. I'm watching Liv and Maddie. But isn't that a lie? Dada, I miss you. I want to go to the beach and go swimming. Kiss. Love you. Bye. Hmm. I feel like, for the most part, we kind of now. I. Oh, there was a, <laughs> a bike motorcycle uh, running past my window uh, but I think for the most part we uh, know what overall happened so to kind of give a review and let me know in the comments down below if you agree or disagree or if I have missed something major um, but I feel like what happened is David get sent on this mission to infiltrate 
this protesters group, uh, the environmental group, but but they're faced Green Storm, I think, right? And he is supposed to influence them, to radicalize them, so the FBI is able to do something about them. In doing so, he meets Ava, who was intended to be a contact for him that he was supposed to seek out and use her to get into the group and get into the center of the group. And from there, we've seen plenty of times where he tries to radicalize them, propose more radical measures um, against this uh, pipeline that is being built by Prosperin, I think is the name. And doing all that, being separated from his wife, Emma, and his kid, Alba, creates more tension in their relationship because their relationship is pretty much built on this incident where david shot what, what was his name i forgot his name already um billy was it billy daniel but um the the ex stalker of emma he shoots him and both have different accounts of what really happened. Emma says that David shoot him or shot, shot him uh, out of jealousy because she hugged him. Uh, but David says he shot him because he saw him grabbing Emma and wanted to protect her. From that, they it kind of is a lingering resentment within there is lingering resentment uh, within emma but she also falls in love with david and they get married and have a child and apparently also the fbi is aware of that because at least it sounded like that of the uh, that they are aware of the incident may even have helped with a cover-up and all that now starts to come to the surface for Emma now that she is separated from David and she at one point she mentions that she's not no longer afraid of David anymore and uh, that has partly to do with not being around him anymore and kind of growing out of his shadow in a way and uh, also she has to deal with her mother who's getting sick and it's getting worse and worse and she eventually dies but while all that happens david also gets into contact with a cam girl called maxine and it appears to me that maxine was the for him the outlet to be honest he had to lie to Emma a lot. He had to lie to Ava a lot. He had to lie to everyone around him. But Maxine was the one person he felt he could be honest with because it was a, a fairly random online contact. And that is, I think, what he needed. He needed an outlet to be honest. And he told her a bunch of stuff. Um among others uh, about his job and apparently some more details as well now during his time infiltrating the the group he seems to genuinely genuinely fall in love with ava at some point he also gets her pregnant and that all while still radicalizing the group while still getting uh or still being in contact with the fbi and at some point then there is a break he uh i think it it, it has to do with ava being pregnant and he becoming a father again 
um, that he realizes what he has done and realizes that Ava and the environmentalist group, they are actually fighting the right fight in his mind. Um, and I'm still not entirely sure how it came to this, but at some point Maxine gets... Um, Gets a gets a visit from an FBI agent, and uh, she threatens David with all the footage uh, that she has, and she apparently got taken into custody, but then released and kind of disappeared uh, from the records, uh, which might have to do with the fact that the FBI severed ties with David as well. He was put on medical leave, uh, and I think. Then we also had multiple um, hints that the FBI might cover up his, this whole thing, their connection with David. And he has to go either into... It, it sounds like that he had to go into hiding, had to leave Ava. And we have this one heartbreaking scene where he is telling her to look into the bathroom mirror and look for the money that he had uh, uh, put there. And he is kind of on the run from then there we have a pretty big gap in our timeline not much not many videos um to watch there which makes sense that if he is on the run if he is fleeing from some uh from somebody in particular the fbi maybe um that he won't be able to make many video calls but we see at one point that he tries to interact with star which is uh, his and Ava's child, but uh, Ava kind of shush, shushes him away. Um, not very happy about that. And then it actually turns out that he makes the decision that he has to stop prospering and has to make things right, I think, in his mind. And the way he tends of doing that is blowing either the pipeline or the bridge that we talked about up and taking his life in the process that is at least how it all looks to me maybe i missed something completely and maybe i misunderstood something completely if that is the case let me know but um that is how i see it right now and i I feel like we investigated that fairly thoroughly. Um, there are certainly uh, still videos that we haven't watched or parts that we haven't watched, but I think this is really, this, this might be it. This might be it. Not really, I don't wanna hit this button, but I feel like we're, we're at a point where we, well, we kind of have to. I mean, we don't have to, but at some point we need to find a conclusion here, right? Um, I'm just thinking about if there's anything in particular that I want to look at. Uh, let me cover, cover up. Cover up. Cover identity. Uh, arrest. Oh, there we have one. Okay, let's look at this. I told you not to arrest them. Yeah, because you used my reports and then the judge threw it out and now they know that there's a traitor. David Jones is dead. Wait a second.
That's great, Mike. It's great. You know a lot about knives. Okay, from when is this video? Because... Okay. That is... So this is after he confronts Maxine, but before the bomb. So I thought for a second that we might have found out a video after the bomb and that the whole bomb explosion may have been just a, uh, a fake death to give him a, an out from the whole group. But this happened afterwards. But maybe we can get uh, the other... Part. There's a myth that handsmith knives are better, but actually these days the machine-made ones are far superior and more reliable. Have a nice vacation, David. Mm, I want what? Ah. Um, David. Okay, so this happens beforehand, before he blows it up. It's all so confusing. if we get any now I, I, I feel like the bomb explosion is the last last video I think I think it might be time. I think it might be time. If I have missed something mind blowing, so let me know in the comments down below. Uh, it's now open for spoilers and uh, discussions and theories and whatnot. Um, so I think we're ending it here. Uh. Once upload starts, it cannot be cancelled. Uh, okay, let's do it. By the way, our character who is uploading this now and was searching that time, we might be a whistleblower of some sort. Probably exposing that the whole attack on the on Prosper and the explosion was an inside job from the FBI. This is all planned out, all connected to David Jones.
So I wonder if there are different endings. It also looks a little bit like Karen from the videos. I think that's it thank you everyone for watching uh i had a great time with, uh, with this game um i think it's really well done it has a very interesting approach and um i just had a good time it is very addicting to search and search and i probably could have continued and find out little bits and pieces but i i feel like we were at the point where uh we found the major beats when we heard what david did Ooh. i took out my wedding ring and threw it into the ocean i will never watch the video he left for us i don't remarry in a few years time i will decide i don't need to be a nurse anymore and will start teaching tennis to girls I will stay fit and always look 10 years younger than I am. Alba will leave home at 18 and do exactly what she wants to do. Mom is right. At 18, I will leave home and do exactly what I want to do. At 40, I will have a child of my own. I will write a hundred names on pieces of paper and then put them in a bag and let her pick hers out. Interesting. Um, so I wonder if there are different ends, um, depending on what you unlock and whatnot. Let, uh, let me know about it. Um, I would love to have a discussion going in the comments if you are interested. Um, but yeah, I really enjoyed the game. Also, let me know how you enjoyed the game, how you enjoyed it compared to her story. I thought, um, for me, it was pretty similar. Um, some things I preferred in her story, some things I preferred in Telling Lies. I thought that the acting was amazing in this game, um, that it was uh, across the board very good from the main actors to the um, uh, supporting cast as well. Um, so uh, really, really just really well done. I, uh, I feel like without getting into the nitty gritty, um, the whole game felt very polished and very consistent in its quality. And I, I really enjoyed that. I really, really enjoyed that. So um, now I think I will let the credits roll and uh, then we can discuss in the comments what you think. Thank you all for watching throughout uh, the entire series. Thank you for all of your support. And if you enjoyed uh, this video and all the other videos consider uh, giving them a thumbs up and maybe subscribing to the channel if you enjoyed it um, lots of more stuff coming up and with liking and subscribing you support the channel a whole bunch and that will bring you even more content in the future i will say my goodbyes now until the next time have a great time bye bye